You'll be surprised to see how well exponential modeling in Excel can forecast future costs in project management. In this video, we'll create and share a dynamic template in Excel with three easy steps. Finding exponential growth or decay trends in our data, logest function for exponential modeling, and forecasting future scenarios. You can follow along by getting the Excel workbook via the provided link in the description below. Step 1 is plotting data to find trends of exponential growth or decay. Our case study includes 11 projects of installing solar panels. The installation costs are increasing exponentially due to factors such as inflation and increased labor costs. The panel prices are decreasing exponentially because of improving manufacturing processes. To investigate trends in our data, we can create a line plot with markers by selecting two columns of cost data. As you can see, installation costs are exponentially growing and panel costs are decaying. Using this plot visualization, we can also estimate intercepts or constant coefficients for our exponential models. Step 2 is using logest function for exponential modeling. We can numerically calculate the growth or decay rate and also intercept of exponential curves using the logest function in Excel or logarithmic estimation. Simply select an array of two cells and insert a function. The first argument is known Ys, which are installation costs in this example. The second argument after the comma is known Xs, which is the year. Remember to press Shift Ctrl Enter for array calculations in Excel. 1.08 is the growth rate or exponential coefficient. In this example, year after year, installation costs are increased by 8%. The intercept or constant coefficient is 3000. This shows the starting value of the dependent variable y when the independent variable x is 0. We can use exp function to formulate our model as installation costs equal 3000 times exp of 8% times year. We follow the same procedure for panel costs or photovoltaic cells. The intercept is 6000 and decay rate is 0.9, showing that year after year panel costs are decreased by minus 10%. We can use exp function to formulate our model as shown here. Step 3 is forecasting future scenarios based on exponential growth or decay modeling. For future years beyond the data range, you will get the forecasted values. We can predict the installation cost in year 11 as an example using our model. This equals 3000 times EXP of 8% times 11. This forecast can be replicated for future years including 15 and 20. We can also predict the decaying panel costs in year 11 using our model. And here it is, an easy and short implementation of exponential regression using only three simple steps in Microsoft Excel. If you found this video useful, please consider subscribing. I hope to have your comments and see you in the next one.